Now, ITT Corporation is a very diversified multi-industry and multinational corporation. Uh, top statistics, we finished last year at about $11.7 billion in sales. We have about 45,000 employees uh, operating in 130 countries around the world. What we do is essentially uh, uh, design, develop, and manufacture high technology engineered components and services for a variety of essential, uh, uh, essential needs throughout the world. Our portfolio is balanced in really three uh, uh, substantial legs or platforms as we would call them. First of all, we're active in defending freedom. Uh, we're a major supplier of sensing, surveillance, electronic warfare, communications, intelligence, and advanced engineering components, primarily for the DOD, Department of Defense, but also for foreign militaries. Uh, we spend a lot of time defending freedom. The second major platform we have is what we call global water uh, leadership or our fluid technology. We are the world's leader in uh, high technology components and equipment to transport and treat water, whether it's treating fresh water, whether it's wastewater, or whether it's a transporting and controlling all aspects of water, a technology is something that we do. And then finally, we have a motion and flow control business that is designing uh, uh, high technology components in energy absorption, friction, uh, aerospace controls for transportation, industrial, and some uh, uh, aerospace markets. The, the, the water market is comprised of multiple levels of distribution, if you will. Uh, we're not in the primary business of manufacturing uh, uh, large-scale water treatment plants. We're going to populate those plants with water equipment. So as a generality, someone like a municipality, a government or a private municipality, would develop a requirement for a new uh, water treatment plant. They would contract with a large uh, engineering company or a large installer of the brick and mortar and cement of the, uh, of the water treatment plant. They would then in turn contact us with respect to the supply of high technology equipment. Well, uh, I can give you a number of them. Uh, most recently, I was in Vienna, Austria, and uh, they had just completed a very, very significant uh, wastewater treatment uh, uh, infrastructure project. In fact, it's the second largest in Europe. I forget the exact uh, uh, capacity, but it was in the several hundred million gallon per day uh, uh, of water, uh, of total wastewater treatment. So all new capital structure, and we formed a partnership, we in partnership with the uh, Vienna uh, municipality, then supplied all of the pumps, all of the control systems, and some of the disinfection technology needed to uh, operate that plant. That plant today is, is, uh, is characterized by having the best water discharge back into the Danube River of many uh, of all of the water treatment plants. So it's heralded uh, along the Danube as something that uh, has been very, very environmentally successful. There's no doubt that access to uh, fresh water and safe and sanitary water is a driving requirement for us to advance population growth in emerging markets, uh, as well as providing the needed necessary environmental responsibility that we're all working so hard for. What's ITT doing? Uh, we're doing a lot. You know, first and foremost, by listening to the customers, we are working to advance both environmentally friendly and energy efficient components. An example is we are a leader in ultraviolet disinfection technology. And last year, we just invented and are now going to production with the world's most energy efficient ultraviolet light bulb, which is transmitting ultraviolet radiation, just like the sun, over a period of time, which is uh, disinfecting water. And so that would be one example I could give you many more in terms of pumping control systems and, uh, and aeration technology and other disinfection technology that's really providing an edge for our company and our customers in terms of energy efficiency and environmental responsibility.